Well, welcome back to this South Western Women's Open. We have an All England clash here between Lucy Beecroft of England and Jasmine Hudson, also of England. Lucy Beecroft has been on tour for nine years so far. Three titles from five. Pretty decent, 61% win rate. 25 years of age. She's up against recently crowned national British national champion Jasmine Hudson, 29 in the world, which is her highest world ranking, just 23 years of age. She's been on tour for eight years now, amassing five trophies from her eight finals so far, and a 54.5 win rate. Another all, uh, you know, another battle of the same country. This one from England. A lot of variety when she has time on the ball. Absolutely, it is a it is an all English challenge, but uh, both these players are from opposite ends of the country. Beecroft, it, a yeah, a little bit surprising in terms of um, seeding. It's not too many people because they're aware of her abilities, but this was the final of the nationals. And of course, it comes up as zero zero because they've never met on the. Beautiful shot. Yeah, nice, brilliant shot from Beecroft from the back of the court, that drop shot, and it sets her up for the, the easy cross. But yeah, I think you're right, Danielle. I think um, probably quite a typical English style, isn't it? Although, both these Don't players. Don't want to stereotype, it, but. <laughs> well, it's not that they're not attacking, it's just that there's perhaps maybe less um, <laughs> risk, risky shots, should we say. Um, bit more rhythm. Yeah, I mean, that shot was certainly on there. I just lost the scoring there. Slightly. It's game ball now. Oh, that's a great, great shot. Finish. Brilliant shot there from Jazz Hutton. Under pressure, couldn't get off court quick enough there. This would be Croft. Disappointed with that first game. Because there's a little point there when Hutton was in in control and then just held a little too long giving Beecroft a chance to get back into the point. A great return to serve there from Hutton. Just absolutely rolled. Showing that they're, they're tough mentally. Oh the drops from the back. It's beautiful. Certainly does. She, she takes it in. It's just a slightly different style, isn't it? That's a, yeah. that's a good width and, and depth there. Just whipping it across the court, forcing the error from B cross racket. Too wide for her to get to them. Sure. Very nice shot. Well, it's a game ball save there for Jazz Hutton. Just edging closer here in this. Second game, it's a one chance squandered for Beecroft. No, it's well played, and there's the roar from Beecroft. It's well deserved. It's a brilliant drop shot off the boast. Really tight. One off. Oh. It's a wonderful body, isn't it? But we covered with ease by Hudson. The drops are so good, and then Hunt's defense has been very impressive. Setting up that ball. Have you played against either of these two? Confused. 
Yeah, very positive start. I'm sure whoever was there uh, coaching her gave her some, some good advice. <laughs> it's clearly working. So much pressure. Taking away those um, restraints of that back, the drop from the back of the court. Yeah, she's negating the, the strengths that Beecroft have, I think, has. I think with Beecroft, if you give her any time, she's, she's able to, to cause you. balls now for Jazz Hutton. She's looking very, very confident. She only did one and she marches off the court. Jasmine Hutton, the current British national champion. Two games to one here. It's been a better performance for Beecroft than the last time they played. British National Finals, but just lost it a little bit towards the end of the third. Oh, nice change of play, but Beecroft got it. Very smart. It's just it's difficult, especially when you train together a lot. It's, it's difficult to play well together all the time. Yeah, it's also tough. Like I think they're both trying to be aggressive on the ball. It's better than I think there's times when you see so many players trying to hit their way out of trouble. Which which can work to an extent, but in general it's just better buy yourself some time and they're both doing a great job of that. Well Hudson's clawed her way back, bring it to six all. After being down five love, it's a very good momentum. Clever shot, really clever shot there. Look at the hold. She doesn't often hold the ball that long, Jazz Hutton, but that was a fantastic shot. Crucial time as well to take her to four match balls here. Really nice structure in these last, the second half of this game. Oh, that's well done. It's well played from Jazz Hutton. It was a really tough match. Slightly closer one than the last time they played. Good performance at times from Lisa Beecroft, but it's Jazz Hutton that comes through 11 9, 9 11, 11 Ladies 6. Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a big round of applause for Lucy Beecroft. Um, Lucy Beecroft, yeah, I'm going to play the back in June, which was actually my last match of the season, so it was quite strange going on for finishing by playing her and playing her again. Um, I was quite edgy today. Um, I mean, equally as edgy being in the British final, but I think there's some sort of pressure when we're playing the first match of the season, and I was really edgy today, and I, I mean, I feel like my brain had about 600 tabs open in my head, so um, I'm just really happy to be doing the fourth one, to be honest. 